Okay, so if you want to get video into Lumen, um, I use VDMX. And the cool thing about VDMX is you can make multiple layers. Okay, so that's two layers. And then um, each of those layers can have a separate siphon output. So you have to add a siphon output plugin. Okay, and now some other plugins you're going to need. And plugins are just um, different components of the interface that you can add as you need them. So it's, it's very flexible. Okay, so I'm going to do another media bin. And I'm going to set this media bin to layer 2. The uh, one that opens by default is set to layer 1. Then I'm going to uh, add two previews, and that's just a little like preview of the layer. And you can have them either before effects or after effects. I'm just going to do um, layer one before effects because I'm not going to use any effects right now. Okay, so then another one for layer two. All right, and now if you go click on the, the siphon output, you see this little window? And now you have all these different siphon outputs. So you can have one for the main output, layer one prefix, layer one, layer two prefix, layer two. So I'm going to turn on layer one and layer two. All right, so now if, if you go to Lumen, under here, you're going to see these uh, siphon sources from VDMX. OK, so let's try that out. So I'm going to grab a clip. And this could be a, a variety of different um, codecs, but um, HAP is the like preferred codec for VDMX. All right, so now that is playing there on layer one. So if we go back to Lumen, change this to layer one. There we go, now it's in there. Okay, so what else can we do? Um, now we have the second media bin. So let's turn this into a recorder. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add another page. And then I'm going to add, I'm going to add Lumen into VDMX using Siphon. So if you go to add clip from built-in sources and then go to Siphon, you'll see Lumen main output. All right, so now, boom. All right, so now that is actually the output from Lumen. So what we can do is in VDMX, go back to the plugins and add a uh, what's it called? Recorder? Move your recorder. Yeah. Okay, so that gives you this little thing. And now you can set a source. I'm going to set the source to layer 2. Because that's where I have that plane. And this will add to... Okay, so when you record a video and you stop recording, it's going to add it to a media bin. So I'm going to have it add to this one, which is just called page. Okay, so now when I go Okay, I messed something up. One second.
Okay. Yeah, so what happened there is I had a, uh, a custom export location because it'll actually export the clips to a folder for you. And I, I had that set for another project somewhere that doesn't exist anymore, so I just had to reset that. All right, so now hit record and then stop, and now that clip is in here. So you can see how powerful that would be because now you can put that clip that you recorded back into Lumen and you know process it even further.